You keep asking way too much of me And I don't know how to say I can be everything you need But I love you But I love you But I love you Too much to let you go Alright, so let's check out the Greg Wells voice centric from uh, from Waves, a pretty simple plugin to use to get uh, really good sounding vocals really, really fast. So it's a pretty simple plugin. Uh, we have an input and an output. Obviously, you want to get your input in about the, the yellow level to get proper processing. So we use this slider right here. You keep asking way too. You don't want to clip. It's going to sound bad. So try to get that into about the yellow. And for any sort of gain compensation or compression sort of compensation, that you need to do, you can do that over here on your uh, output side. We also have built-in effects, and a really cool thing about all of these effects is they're already set up for vocals. So for a delay, for example, you're not going to have to go through a bunch of different presets or a hundred different parameters trying to get it to sound right. For a vocal, it's already set up to sound perfect for a vocal. You just turn it on, adjust the amount, and you're you know good to go. Same thing for the rest of our uh, effects here. So here in our intensity knob, there's a bunch of stuff that goes on behind the hood. There's some EQ, there's some compression, uh, and some things don't really turn on until around 60 and even around 80. So let's go ahead and fix her off. Let's just check out our intensity knob right here. I can be everything you need, but I love you. Turn it up. But I love you. Much more compressed. You. But I love you too much. So that's too much uh, compression there. Let's pull it down now. About halfway. But I love you. That's pretty good for this. But I love you. So it's more present. But I love you too much. Right, it's more present. It's more even. We can see our gain reduction over here, by the way, in our meter. So if I turn this all the way down. But I love you too much to let. So it sounds fine, but it sounds even better up around 60 or so in this case. But I love you too much to right. let more you even, go. More even, more present. But I love you. All right. So again, just adjust this to whatever sounds good to use. Like I said, it's a really easy uh, plugin to use. So let's go ahead and check out the delay. By the way, there are there are um, presets available, but you really don't need them because there's just a few little parameter changes uh, that you. Uh, need to do here so let's pop on the delay need, but I love you. turn it up but I love you. too much of course but, I love you. but just adjust too of course to uh to let you go. it's pretty good there but I we turn it off for now and turn on the doubler just to uh, hear that but I love you too much to let you go but I love you, but I love you. So this is sort of a lead vocal, but you could use this on uh, background vocals as well. Sort of spread things out, make it sound even richer, more full like that. For this, I think somewhere around there is probably good. And check out the reverb again, because it's already set up for vocals. We're not having to go through a bunch of different parameters and trying to find a good reverb for vocals. It's already you know built right in here. But I love you too much to let you go. And it sounds great. But I love too much, of course, but adjust but that I love you. to taste. But I thought that's pretty good. You too much to let you go. All right. Then put it all together right there. But I love you too much to let you go. Turn it off. But I love you. But I love you. And on. But I love you too much to let you go. All right. Let me hear this part right here. And we'll start her at about, oh, say 33. Tell me, do you wanna? Tell me, do you wanna stay? So it goes up a bit too high there. It's a little bit too dynamic. If I turn this off completely. Tell me, do you Tell me, do you wanna stay? Right. A little bit too dynamic, but if I 
take this all the way up. Now it's really going to compress down here. Tell me, do you wanna? Tell me, do you wanna stay? All right, so now it's not dynamic enough. So, like I said, there's things going on behind the scenes that they don't really talk about uh, exactly what they've sort of strung together uh, inside here. And some things, like I said, they turn on around 60, other things turn on around 80 or so. So you're just going to have to use your ears. I usually find somewhere between, you know, 40 and 65 or so usually sounds pretty good and just makes a vocal pop right through uh, real quick and real easy. So around 63 here, about these settings right here will be uh, pretty good. Tell me, do you want to tell me, do you want to stay? So, so much better than just dry. Tell me. Sounds fine, but tell me, do you wanna stay? Sounds even better with uh, our voice centric on this here. Tell me, do you wanna? Tell me, do you wanna? 